The flag folding ceremony represents the same principle on which the United States of America was originally founded, freedom, honor, and faith. And this ceremony is conducted when the flag is retired from service, and then most often it is retired in honor of a fallen soldier. Prepare the flag for folding. The portion of the flag denoting honor is the canton of blue containing the stars, which represents the states from which our veterans served in uniform. The canton field of blue dresses from left to right, and it is inverted and draped as a pall on a casket of a veteran who has served our country in uniform. Our hope and prayer is that for this ceremony is that Sergeant Seth Randall Trahan, as well as all Americans who have fallen while serving our country, will not be forgotten, but their lives will live forever. The first fold of the flag is a symbol of life. The second fold of the flag is a symbol of our belief in the eternal life. The third fold is made in honor and remembrance of the veteran departing our ranks who gave a portion of their life for the defense of our country to attain a peace throughout the world. The fourth fold represents our weaker nature, for as American citizens trusting in God, it is to him we turn in times of peace as well as in times of war for his divine guidance. The fifth fold is a tribute to our country, for in the words of Stephen Decatur, our country, in dealing with other countries, may she always be right, but it is still our country, right or wrong. The sixth fold is for where our hearts lie. It is with our heart that we pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The seventh fold is a tribute to the armed forces, for it is through the armed forces that we protect our country and our flag against all enemies, whether they are found within or without the boundaries of our republic. The eighth fold of the flag is a tribute to the one who entered into the valley of the shadow of death, that we, may, that we may see the light of day, and to honor mother for whom it flies on Mother's Day. The ninth fold is a tribute to womanhood, for it has been through their faith, their love, and loyalty and devotion that the character of men and women who have, been, who have made this country great have been molded. The tenth fold is a tribute to Father, for he too has given his sons and daughters for the defense of our country since they were first born. The eleventh fold in the eyes of the Hebrew citizen represents the lower portion of the seal of King David and King Solomon, and it glorifies in their eyes the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. And the twelfth fold in the eyes of the Christian citizen represents an emblem of eternity and glorifies in their eyes God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. When the flag is completely folded, the stars are uppermost, reminding us of our national motto, in God we trust. <laughs> 